Hey guys, how's it going? It's Blakeu92 again here with uh, Avid Capture Tool Part 2. I hope you guys stopped by and watched the first one because we went over several important theoretical stuff about capture tools and basically uh, we went over the importance of project settings as far as your format goes for your SD or HD project and we went over things like naming tapes and selecting tapes and making sure all that was all set up right. I even went over power scheme options and uh, hardware connection advice with the 1394 DNA button right here. You're never going to know what that is unless you watch the previous video so if you just happen to go into this one you might as well go to the other one too. So in this video yeah this time we're going to be going over uh, input formats, resolutions, differences between the MXF and the OMF format structure that Avid likes to use, the old and new capturing options and uh, yeah we're even gonna show you how this very first step you can do to start capturing your footage so I highly recommend watching all of this in a row if you're going to and like I say in all my other videos, if you haven't seen any of my videos so far, I'm a Final Cut Pro certified user and an Avid Media Composer certified user, but that doesn't mean that I'm a certified instructor in either of those programs, because I'm not, but I just decided to put these videos online for you guys' benefit because I know there aren't very many of them out there and people tend to struggle with Avid quite a bit since it's not advertised to the consumer level or anything.